After searching and navigating through the challenges of the current Denver real estate market, you finally find the perfect home. All the boxes are checked and we put an offer in that's accepted. Now, how do we ensure that it doesn't fall out of escrow? Hi everyone, Pamela with Pamela Not a Real Estate and EXP Realty. And there are a lot of steps that go into ensuring that we make it to the finish line. Let's go over a few tips that will help you from falling out of escrow. First, prepare yourself for the inspection. Many older homes will have different surprises than newer homes. The best thing to do is to have a realistic understanding that the condition of the home may reflect its age. Expecting to have a perfect inspection will only leave you disappointed and a perfect inspection rarely happens. And don't be afraid to negotiate. The inspection report is a lengthy report, but there is also room to negotiate for anything major. Having a real estate agent who can provide guidance and communication with the seller and the seller's agent is critical so that it doesn't put your home purchase at risk. And also, be honest about your credit. While you have been pre-approved for the loan, this does not mean go shopping for new furniture or a new car. Your pre-approval is based on a number of factors and your debt to income ratio is one of the biggest ones. Any change in your credit while you are in escrow could find you without financing for the new home. And then at closing time, have all required documents ready when we go to close and additional documentation that will be discussed ahead of time. And going through escrow and transferring those keys is a team effort with lots of parties involved. Let's start your journey of homeownership together. Again, this is Pamela with Pamela Not A Real Estate and subscribe, like, and comment. Let's stay connected.